Alright everyone, welcome back to another Mob Bros video. I'm Tucker, and I'm sure as you guessed by the title, I'm going to be talking about the rival Hercules or Heracles, however you want to pronounce it. Um, so, fresh out of the box, it looks basically like a Kronos. Um, I've had this for about a day. Um, all I did to it was take out the locks to make it a little easier to play with. But, I don't like it. It's a weird blaster. It's a Kronos if you cover that up and that up. See, it's just a Kronos. And they add this huge thing on the bottom, which isn't really needed. Uh, I just think they're trying to hop on the train that is the popularity of the Kronos. And they gave us this. It has Kronos internals. Um, performs just like a Kronos. You'll see that in just a second. Um, there's a few things I like about it. I think the camo pattern's kind of cool. I like how it's a Kronos. And this front grip here, if you put your hand on the front, it's pretty comfortable to hold, actually. Nice and compact feeling. And I don't necessarily like that all that much, but I think this does it well. Um, and the things I don't like about it, I just... They did something to the slide, they changed it, so it's really weak and flimsy now. See, you can see it flex. Um, and if you can see in there, it's a little, like, detention tab that you push with this switch. And it locks into a thing on the top of the shell that prevents you from moving the slide back and forth. Uh... I, I, it's super weird because what they did was they connected it to the priming indicator so you could cut it off if you wanted to um, or you could just take the priming indicator out like I did um, I f they added some little stippling onto the handle here which I think is sort of neat um, they didn't really do any other changes to it they rounded the back of the handle just a tiny bit. Um, I mean, I'll show you the performance test now. It's standard <laughs> Kronos performance, but it's, it is what it is. I think what they did here at the top is sort of cool. They took away the, the door that was here and just put a little open spot. So you can see, see right in. Um, here, let's just shoot right here. I'd say that's in about 90, 92 FPS. It's rival performance, Chronos performance. It's alright. I don't really like it. I'm sure some people out there will like it. But I don't think this is necessary. If they wanted to put something down there, they could have extended the mag down. They could have done something like the Apollo. Um, they could have done something like they did with the Atlas and put a mag in the handle here. They could have shrunk the, the whole thing down, which I think is possible. Um, well, of course it's possible. J Jacob did it. Mag fed out of the handle. But right here, they could have done that so much easier by just integrating it directly into the shell and you could have the rival mag go up through it. Um, I don't know. I don't get why this is a thing. I feel like it's a waste of a, a cool name that they could have used on something better. I think they're releasing a lot of rival blasters, obviously, and I really liked the Jupiter. I think they took the Kronos package and did something really cool with it. I just think it fell a little short on this. Um, that's really all I have to say about it. Um, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.